Oh yeah, I think I should tell my friends that I'm going live right now. Um, hold on. Okay, I am live, I am live, uh, going live. What else? Uh, I'm a little bit tired right now actually, so I'm not even sure if I should be even like doing this because I still have a, a bunch of videos to edit and stuff. Yeah, let me just open something else in. Oh yeah, the videos. Uh, okay, that's done. Done. Come on, Facebook. Come on, work with me here. Hi, <laughs> hi, my little newbies. <laughs> Welcome back. And uh, yeah, let me just uh, sort of get an introduction out. Uh, I'm Kiri Jake, and this is a drawing stream. So today, uh. Uh, I will be redrawing like one of like uh, my characters from uh, Fighters. Uh, okay, like, I think in the title I call it a redesign, but it's not so much of a redesign. It's more so like just a uh, like a uh, proportion like fix. That, that's really it. So, and it will be like this particular character right here. And so what? I will be doing here. I think it's just mostly. Like, I wanna just sort of redo like the whole proportion to be more of a. Uh, I'm gonna get in so much trouble first saying this. Uh, I'm gonna redo it into more of like a lolly, a lolly like uh, uh proportion. So because I think even like this one, like she just doesn't look as like uh. Ouch. Like you, you can see from a height here, right? Just, just look at from right. I still feel it. Still feels like you know she's. Uh, <laughs> you want you draw Alistair Clyde? <laughs> oh no, the Tumblr tweet is getting to you. <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's 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 not it's not fixing. I'm just redoing like uh some. Like just trying to change like a proportion of the. Uh, character so. I think that's all of it. I I don't even think I'm gonna be like uh uh giving like colors as well since the color is gonna be the same anyway. So as I was saying, I think this one just looks too much like she's taller than she actually looks. 
like you know than a listed high so i'm just gonna like try to fix the proportion a bit so uh, i want to make it look like you know like like she's actually like you know like her her own height so uh well yeah, i will be watching like, uh youtube video on the side uh and actually let, let me just test out something uh just let me know if you can actually like hear anything in the background um let's see uh Hmm. Uh, see. Fucking ads. Okay. Do you, do you guys hear anything from the the background? So just give a confirmation. I think it's just the fan, right? Cause. Uh, Oh god, where there goes my chat. You have to... Okay, well, it, if it works then I suppose... Uh, yeah, I can just sort of start a video in the background. Yeah, just the fan. Okay. So I think it's just uh, we're gonna start. Usually, like the head. Okay. Anyone here like still like hear like a background like video? Yeah, it's hot in here, right? It's hot in here, okay, so just... <laughs> and by hot in here, I mean like, it's always hot in here, so you just bear with like the fan. No, okay, good. So let's just start. So I think now we should start a bit from like the... So you still listen, you still hear the video, is it? Oh well, fuck, I suppose we just do it like, you know, silent, then just... Maybe it helps me, you know, actually draw faster if I'm not watching a video in the background. So let's just sort of start with like, a face here. So I think now the face, um... I'm not gonna change much. He just uh, I'm just gonna keep like the like mommy and like her, her roundish like face. So there's that. I even have like the desktop audio like muted just so, but sometimes I just like to use like speaker instead of like my. It's a bit wearing headset a uh, prolonged period of time. It can get can be quite like a, a pain. <laughs> Copyright free background music like mm, uh, I'm just to, to hell with it. I don't really have like a yeah, well I think just like what the, the standard like Kevin McLeod the that that soundtrack. That, that's about it. Like the father of you know like YouTube, <laughs> uh, background music. So I think that's sort of like the body, and so this is like put like so this is like where the, the neck should be at. So I think this time we're just gonna like really narrows down like the the shoulder. And then uh, hold on.
the thing I'm just gonna look at like look up for like some reference and So it is usually how like, I start like drawing out like my characters uh So we just have like, a bunch of circles here. Then thing here is when like So here's sort of like what I'm trying to get rid of is like mostly like this curve. Like there's like a way too much of like curve here that makes her I think it just makes her look more like uh, taller than I think this is like this curve here and you know the chest I suppose. I think that's like sort of like what I think is what makes her look like taller than she actually is. So I'm just gonna from here I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to make like her, her body like as short, like you know, as as I possibly could without making it look like very, you know, like off putting. I think I just like nailed that down already. Okay, next. Uh, ow, uh, So actually let's just sort of get this line across so sort of like in the properly in the middle. Okay, now the legs part because originally I just sort of make her like you know have like like this like small upper body but crazy like you know like like even for us like crazy like thick like thighs but you know that is you know is what I like. So I think this, even the legs, I'm just gonna try like if, see if I can just sort of get away with like shortening the legs. Yeah, I think maybe like just sort of like I took a bit too much inspiration from like Kana, I suppose. Uh, Okay, so that's that. Let's look again. Like so, like it's perfectly straight. So. Yeah, 
gonna put a knee somewhere around here. And then Tiring lately. Yes. I think here we should be getting somewhere like with this so. I think I think her arm should be like a bit more like shorter so okay, I think now we should be getting somewhere with this sort of spin it a little I don't know I think it should be good but This is a good. I think we have like a sort of like a good uh, rough, like reference on where to go about. So I'm gonna change to a different pencil. Yeah, I'm just still like so tired right now, but it's like so fucking hot. Uh, man, I just... <laughs> I think this is just like basically everyone, everyone right now, like... It's so fucking hot, I don't even want to go to work anymore, but... I don't know this is one artist that really makes like a good uh, 
Okay, how do I say lolly drawings? Uh, it feels so wrong to say it, like it's not an SFW. I can promise you that. I think I might be speaking too much with it. I think I'll try to make this quick. I think this is just gonna be like nothing more than like few sketch. I just, uh, I mean, it's sort of like, if you just sort of want me to say something like, um, have something to talk about. I just watched uh, Gundam Seed Freedom yesterday with my, with my buddy, with my bro. It's, uh, I would say it's pretty good, actually, like, and that's coming from someone that, like, you know, I, I hate it. Like, like, actually like hate like Gundam Seed uh, I mean as a seed, as far as like being a series goes like, I, I hate Gundam Seed but If you're just gonna boil it down to like the map design I freaking love Seed As far as like you know for their map design goes and stuff And yesterday I, I watched it with my friend and I think it's just sort of the one thing I came out from the cinema Like literally just like one thing I've been saying is just like Man, a a Agnes, Agnes is a thought. Like, well, I think was, I think that's just something about like the villains in <laughs> Random Seed. I think it just feels like a bit too like uh. I think even like in Random Seed standard, it just it just feels like a bit more too like cartoony. I suppose like they just evil uh okay, i wouldn't say like you know like jack horner type of like evil like he's evil for the big sake of being evil and he's more so like the villain in uh see freedom i think it just it just goes a bit a little bit like over the top where i think it just went like a little bit over the top with it with like the villains you know like the whole thing of like you know every villain like is a hero of their own story but that's like this villain is like okay and I think the best way to describe it, it right as like okay there's some villains where you can describe it as like the sort of like two like litmus tests there's two types of like bad guys there's like Emperor Nero type of bad guy where like Nero is like, yep, he is he's a bad guy and he knows he's a bad guy. And then there's another one I would call like 
the Caligula bad guy where he's like Cal like Emperor not his real name but he just like by his nickname uh, Caligula is like he's evil and he's he's bad shit crazy so that's sort of how like I differentiate like the like, all the villains and the villains in Gundam Seed Dream they're just all like <laughs> they're all like freaking like Caligula that's what I got from it And and to be fair, I mean, like also another thing I just sort of realized, like the movie it may be two hours long, like already, but I don't feel like it does. I would say the move the Gundam Supreme would benefit from actually being sort of like a, a little like more of like a short series, like somewhere like you know like one to five episodes, or at least like you know a movie like. I think there's there's actually quite a lot for like two movies worth of uh, of story in like Gundam Seed Freedom that I, that could be I think could be like you know like uh, elaborated like a bit more. I mean that is what I think about it, but I think in the end I I say I I say the movie actually just sort of like fixes core <laughs> fixes like one of like. Like okay, not fix. Like address like that one issue. Like, yeah. like the reason why I hate like Gundam Seed so much is is because of Kira Yamato. Like, like I just hate Kira Yamato so much that I remember I bought like the DVD set for like uh, Gundam Seed and Seed Destiny, like a combo set. Like yes, I, I was that old. I used to buy like still used to buy like a physical. And I think I, I remember I was, after I watched like Gundam Seed, I, I remember I hate it so much. I actually just skip Seed Destiny, like the entire Seed Destiny, like uh, like anime series. And I think it just perfectly like the movie addressed like that issue, that kind of issue like what I'm having with Kira is basically dude has some. Um, like some serious like uh what is it i think it's something they call it like uh either savior complex or hero complex i think it's one of those two and i think this is just so like i don't even, like, i don't even know at, even at first like what, what's the my issue with kira now i can say like i finally like, got it now that, oh yeah he has like a bit of a savior complex which is ironic because bro actually like uh like he's the one that actually like you know take like actually like you know like ruin like a savior Gundam I think maybe the legs like that. I think that should do it for like the legs. I'm gonna make her legs a bit more like skinnier.
So I think it's just sort of got the gist of it, like fighting with like the body. So I think now is the arms. Just make it you know, slightly longer so it doesn't like. Now here comes the part where it sort of like, uh, gets a bit more tricky, the feet. I think even here, I think I'm just sort of made like the feet and I think even like the hands here like too big. So it sort of like broke the whole like a lolly feel to her. So I'm gonna try and make it like, like smaller here. I think I made a feet like maybe too small the feet is I think at least like I think like the like the left foot is a bit too small. I think it's sort of nailed it right here, so now it gets to a bit of a tougher part, I suppose, the hands. The thing here, I make like the arms like too meaty and too big, so I want to avoid that here. So I'm going to change to a different color pen and smaller. Okay.
think it's sufficiently like small enough to like you know it's sort of like you know small and it's cute. I think that's also sort of like the whole appeal of like mommy is supposed to be like you know like the cute one and that's you know kind of like my 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 aesthetic choice for her. I'm still tired right now. You know, I should be uh, should be editing a video I think later tonight as well. So what is that? Okay, so so usually I'll actually recycle recycle like layers or so this is that. Okay, I think a head size is okay as it is. <coughs> I think maybe because like the reason why head size looks like so big is I think maybe because like the like the lack of the other arm just sort of make like the shoulder way smaller and it just makes the hip looks too big and that's just sort of like you know my, my own theory I suppose and uh, uh, uh. oh uh. So I think might as well just gotta get this quick. Uh, yeah, I think this is this is not gonna take up a lot of space, isn't it? It's just gonna draw this one section here. I mean, I'm gonna call it a day. And I think maybe I'll also like fix sort of the eyes a bit. Like the eyes here is maybe like too round, I think too open and stuff. I don't know, just sort of like, so sort of get that like fix. I think I'm still gonna stick to like the whole like, original like the round around this eye but I'm just gonna make it more like like the boring eyes. Maybe, maybe it's a bit too close.
was like, you, what do you think about I just sort of one day like I switch up like my streaming time a bit so uh, instead of doing it like, usually what I'll do is I'm gonna do it like, at night because usually I'll doing it I'll be doing it like, after work. Is that that boring, the constantly bored like? Uh, I know. Is it? I think this is what I call like uh, the resting bitch phase, right? <laughs> I think that's sort of I think I can sort of like nailed it like the eyebrow here like give it more of like a permanent I think I just sort of have like this part of the head obscure like part of the face so it can make it like sort of like her, her head looks a bit smaller so I'm gonna make it like you know it's all like you know taken up by the hair I think I'm gonna add a bit more like extra like, bit here so and then of course the that I I would say that sort of like this one would be like a most like distinct signature look. Uh, I like calls it the, the cat ear like the hair hairpin thing and that's probably like the twin tails
I think yeah, you just sort of make like in the comic right where like she doesn't have like that much of a long hair but like, she just sort of have like a lip like quite like a large like twin tail so I'm gonna make like this little twin tails here like I think I'm gonna make it like smaller than like the manga so I think that's sort of like the head done and Oh she, I mean I think just the head alone that's like a more longy like look than compared to like this one. Now you just wanna like just wanna do like a little comparison um this and this So I think here yeah, I just want to make the, the neck uh, a bit too big and I think I can sort of like further even shrink the neck because again this is just sort of anime logic just sort of like don't don't overthink about it too much so That's a little like see this is what they call like a turtle neck. So I think it, I just so so can like simplify like this like not here so just like this. I think, I think I also make this a little like scarf like here like slightly bigger just sort of to emphasize like, you know, how small like you know the smallness I suppose so. Yeah, it's actually like just ended here, so I'm gonna make it all the way down to like the waist here. I think I was saying uh, I know what you thought about like, I want to change it like change out like my schedule a bit Wait, instead of streaming on like at least I'm here like in Malaysia in here instead of streaming either on afternoon or night I want to try doing it more in the morning just so okay, to be just sort of my point is I uh, just maybe I can reach a bit more audience that is like an you know, audience that is like not Malaysian it might have fair, but I think as far as like solo stream goes, I could like focus, like put like uh, like put more on like my
Actually, that does just make her like you know she's now like completely. What is it? Petan. <laughs> Suppose. I mean, to be fair, she is so like canonically she is how like mostly like Petan compared to like a mother Yuki, which <laughs> literally two worlds apart. You can catch my drift. <laughs> This is why, like most people, when they actually like, I give like commission during cons, like, uh, like a lot of people will draw her like you know extra like busty and extra like tall. I think maybe I'm just gonna assume like that's like how like the way I draw like her proportion. Maybe it just doesn't like reflect like how I actually wanted her to look like. So. So I think this is like here. YouTube is already public domain. Hey Andreas, welcome to the stream. Uh, YouTube is already pu public domain. Uh. Well, what, what do you mean? Like, uh, do you mean like sort of like the the music or just any video I I'm watching in the background? Because I think mostly I'm just trying to like minimize like my risk on you know sometimes. YouTube can be a little bit fucky. If you know what I mean. Like free BGM, like yeah. So I, I think usually I'm just gonna use like the you know like the, those kind of like you know annoying Kevin MacLeod. Like uh, I think just to show you what I mean. Um, like free BGM. Okay, it's not even like free BGM. I usually I will be like watching videos on the background whenever I'm, I'm like drawing. So. <coughs> Well, I was actually trying to like just mute like you know my like I do mute my uh <laughs> thunder <laughs> still quite on mp3 but yeah usually I will I I do like mute third my like desktop audio just that um I'm actually still using speaker so chances are whatever I'm watching it's still gonna be like captured on like my my microphone through my speaker and I'm actually using like like sort of like not like I'm using I'm not using like a headset microphone I'm using like a like a dedicated microphone and let's just say it tends to be a bit too sensitive on what it captures so I think for me, it just I just really like uh, yeah, that's very ungamer like of me. But I don't really like wearing headset, like especially like prolonged period. And 
extra especially since like again once again you know Malaysia weather is just it's unreasonably hot these days so wearing a headset with like you know a leather and all that stuff it's just gonna make apps like it's just gonna make it cook up like the heat so much <laughs> and this is gonna make me so I mean, even right now like I have like my okay we can say this the reason why I still haven't bought like a quote unquote uh, sort of like a racing seat style gamer chair is because like my thigh is gonna like sweat a lot I wear like short pants and I'm probably like gonna like what the the leather like the whatever PU leather they're gonna have like on the seat is gonna like wear off in in like what three days it's just gonna start be flaky in three days so that's why I even until now I seven still haven't bought like a proper uh, gamer chair but I do have this uh, <laughs> these actually what, what, what is it what is it called uh, <laughs> It was I, I think I remember watching this like gamer chair boy was this so. what is it <laughs> yeah the DX racer 6000 and that's what I'm that's what I'm si uh, sitting on right now the, the quote unquote DX racer 6000 if you know that meme you know <laughs> just use like a normal comfy chair bitch yeah I mean I'm just I'm just using a plastic chair because like it's Again, it, it's what works and uh, to be fair, actually I did bought like sort of like this office chair, you know, with perforated seats and and whatnot, but I think it just sort of makes my the Virgil chair the lawn chair or whatever. <laughs> yeah yes. The most gamer of chairs. And right now it's just because it's so hot, right? I actually have a put a towel a towel on my chair just to just sort of absorb all the sweat from my thighs <laughs> and uh and it's not like what it's not like i can sell i can sell off like those sweats you know because i'm, I'm a guy <laughs> yeah perks <laughs> downsides of being a dude you can't sell your own sweat <laughs> <laughs> base <laughs> so yep she has tiny hands now cute tiny little kitty paws and also like short Okay, maybe I can get away a bit, a bit more just to like a thicker ties, like a bit like Kana. Let me just sort of like see if I can like get this part right. Yeah, I think again, this is like, it's just so hot. This, like, you know, like those like, artist glove where there's like it only like, covers like the the last two digits of your like thing like on your hands like the fingers, and it just like covers so it like you know wouldn't like so it wouldn't like sort of damage it. I was, I actually also stopped wearing that glove once again. <laughs> Malaysia weather. <laughs> oh my god! It's and it's only like what? <laughs> it's only like fucking. April, it's only April. Imagine July. 
<laughs> July, because July that's like what the typical like summer month. <laughs> oh my god, imagine July which he reached uh coincidentally it's my birthday. So God man. Also you know I sort of wish I can show you show off like a little something except um Yeah the weather can kill <laughs> You know, like those, like you know, a uh, weather reporter memes. Like it's like, oh, everyone, he, everyone in this town is dead. <laughs> like you see, like this unreasonably high <laughs> temperature, like uh, like numbers. It's like everyone in this town is dead. <laughs> yeah, that's basically like us right now. <laughs> Malaysia, Indonesia. So let me just get to the shoes there. I make the ankle like a bit too long, so... I think maybe the ankle has to be like to redo a bit. Like the, I, I you know I want to call it sort of like a what like little signature Figma leg, cause the joint of this like the pro the prosthetic is, is based on like a Figma like the joints. And actually, also a little bit of like a smart doll by Danny Chu and. Speaking of which, uh, actually I just look back some of like my old for my con photos right, and I just sort of. Let's just say I just sort of remembered, oh yeah, I met this guy twice. So, uh, like this really super famous <laughs> ce local celebrity twice and... You know, by the way, that the local cele celebrity name is Jimmy Choo, so yes, I... Okay, I think I met him three times, I took photo with him twice, so... There's this like that. So and I think that's like the closest I've ever gone to like you know taking photos with like a celebrity. Yeah, yeah. I think I just have to recenter this part of the shoe. Yeah, I think this is as close as we can get to like a uh, sort of like a lolly mommy. Oh, okay, that, that rhymes. That rhymes well, actually. I think maybe I just have to like sort of make like this part a bit more smaller. Thighs. Yeah, I can escape with this, but I think it's this we can have to like. So I 
you know, I think I think sort of that's sort of about it. I think I sort of nailed it a bit. The uh, I think proportionally wise, I think this works better than like like this. Especially again, like you you look at at her height, right? She's like like stupidly short. I think this reflects like that state height better than this. So. Well, you know, I really, I'm not even sure if I'm going to intend to make this like a long, um, a long stream, but you know, I think I just sort of set out to do what I want to do already in this stream, so I'm um, guessing I'm going to call it a stream right now, plus I have like what, two to three videos to edit later, and which I'm going to need to like upload it, so I, I suppose I'm going to, I'm just going to end the stream like right now. And oh yeah, okay, maybe maybe just uh just a little like showcase to you guys. You know what? Never mind. I think I'll think I'll just. I think you you know what I want to show like when I finally do edit the video and. So uh, I I think that's it. I think that's really it. I'm gonna call it the stream. So. Uh yeah, I just you know uh thank you guys. So I think I'm just gonna go straight to my closing speech. So thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, I'm Kirisaki Jake, and uh, I'll see you when I see you. Ah, uh, man, I need, man, I'm hungry. I'm hungry.